a number for Wednesday, kids. Join me as I learn how to count, solve, and enjoy math. This is Teacher Jurel, and welcome to our class. It was Mel's first time riding on a train. As she waits for the train, she looks at the map to check how many cities are there from the first up to the last station. She noticed that each city is marked on a straight path. The train map showing each city on a straight path illustrates the basic concepts of geometry. For today's session, we will talk about the basic concepts of geometry such as lines, line segments, and rays. Are you ready, kids? Come on and let us begin our number four journey. Before we proceed to the lesson, I would like to invite you all to a magical learning experience at home with Vibal's Happy Homeschool program. You may enroll in a standalone program in math. Just check the link in the description box to learn more. As we learn about the basic concepts of geometry, we will answer these two questions. First, what is geometry? Second, what are the basic concepts of geometry? Come on, let's start answering these questions. Do you still remember what geometry is? Geometry is a branch of mathematics that deals with points, lines, angles, surfaces, and solids. Now, let's identify the basic concepts of geometry one by one. Do you know what this is? Great! This is a point. A point is an exact location. It is named using a capital letter. The illustration is point A. How about this? Awesome! This is a line. A line is a set of points on a straight path extending endlessly in opposite directions. It is named using two distinct points represented by two letters. The illustration is line AB or BA. What do you call this? Very good! This is a line segment. A line segment is a part of a line with two endpoints. It is also named using two distinct points represented by two letters. The illustration is line segment CD or DC. Now, take a look at this. Do you know what this is called? Correct! This is a ray. A ray is a set of points on a straight path with a starting point and extends endlessly in one direction. It is named with its endpoint and by the point on which it is extending. The illustration is ray AB. Lastly, can you name this? Splendid! This is an angle. An angle is a union of two rays with the same endpoint. The common endpoint is called the vertex of the angle. An angle can be named using only the vertex or using three letters where the middle letter is the vertex and the other two are points on the sides. The illustration is angle E or angle NEL or LEN. Now, let's see what we have understood. Game? Let's go! Can you name all points here? Nice! The points are H, E, J, F, I, G, and K. Now, can you name all three lines here? Good job! The three lines are line EG, line HK, and line JI. Can you name at least six line segments here? Very good! The six line segments are line segments FE, FG, FH, FK, FJ, and FI. 
Can you name at least six rays here? Fantastic! The six rays are rays Fe, Fg, Fh, Fk, Fj, and Fi. Can you name at least six angles here? Awesome! The six angles are angles EFJ, KFJ, GFK, GFI, HFI, and EFH. You did great, kids! Now, Let's go back to our two questions earlier. Geometry is a branch of mathematics that deals with points, lines, angles, surfaces, and solids. The basic concepts of geometry are point, line, line segment, ray, and angle. You're fantastic! I hope you learned a lot about the basic concepts of geometry today. If you did, Click thumbs up and share this video to help young learners like you to count, solve, and enjoy math. Don't forget to click the subscribe button. Of course, to experience the magical learning at home, check out Vival's Happy Homeschool program. Just click the link in the description to learn more. Again, this is Teacher Jarel and see you on our next number 4 Wednesday.